Hi everyone, it's Claire at Diamond Painting Nerd. Welcome to a little kitting up video. So I am doing something slightly different today and I'm actually gonna kit up two kits in one case. So let's go. I'm using um, two art dot kits. So these are the two paintings that they have available, the rose and the butterflies. And I've said before, in these art dot cases, you can um, kit up several paintings in the one case. So I'm going to do that as an experiment on this occasion. The one that I'm using, um, they have very similar colour count. Um, and so this is the reason I wanted to do it. Now, these have a, um, I think one has, or oh, they both have 35-ish colours. So um, the 30 pot case wasn't going to be big enough um, to kit up in. So it'd have to go up to the next one, which is the 60 pot case. So in this case, there are two rows of um, 60. So I'm going to kit one kit up in the top row and then one kit up in the bottom row. Um, so let's get started. Let's start with the smaller one. And what I'm going to do is take out the top tray and then I can just move the case out of the way and just work with this. So I've already unboxed these on my channel and I just love the, I love these. Um, they're such good value um, for a diamond painting. Um, the canvases are beautiful. And this one should be, again, another little one that I can just complete of an evening. Maybe not of an evening, two evenings. A little snack size. They do do this one in a bigger one, but I went for the small one. So you get your drills and you also get a sticker sheet. Um, so that sticker there will go into my logbook, um, which I don't have to hand at the minute. And then the stickers here are for the drills. So let's get, let's get rid of the plastic and let's get these kitted up. So uh, what's going to be the best way around doing this? So we have... So there's, yeah, 35 colours, and I think these are all done in number order. Da, 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 da. Oh, no. Yeah. Oh, yes. Yes. Number one through 35. So um, we seem to have letters and numbers and just a few symbols. So that is exactly how I'm going to kit these bottles up. So we have number 154, and that just purely um coincidentally corresponds to that now i need to find my scissors here we are so number one five four so this is obviously going to be a bit of a longer video um because i'm going to be um hitting up two paintings I suppose it'll be no different to when I kit up um, a 60 plus colour painting. Bring over my trash bin that I got from Timu, which I use for the empty packets. So then we have number two, which is 158. So if this is all done in DMC order, this is going to make kitting down an absolute dream because I will be going with the, um, my drills will be stored in number and then alphabetical order, which I think is exactly how they've got them um, on here. So number three, 208. in there oh of course I had to spill some oh no I think that's it oh shout if you see a random drill lying around anywhere okay so there's not a great deal in these packets but I wouldn't expect there to be because if there's 35 colors um, and this is a 35 by 25 painting I suppose it's not going to be a great deal of drills so, number four is 300. I am loving. I am loving that the 
um, the actual codes. And, oh, just a few there. The codes and the, um, the DMC numbers are all in order. So yeah, kitting down is going to be an absolute dream with these kits. So then we have five, which is 307. So the sticker on this one, can you see is blue as opposed to white? And that looks like it denotes that this is a an AB drill. So beautiful yellow AB. Get those all in there. Plenty of those. So that was number five. And we have six. Maybe I might pop these stickers on quickly. Seven, eight, oh, nine. <laughs> Okay, oh no, they don't go in order because then they go, uh, okay, the letters then go random. So let's finish off doing these. Oh, so yeah, the numbers are going to be brilliant because they seem to be all in order. But then the um, the actual letters aren't in DMs. They're in DMC order, but they're, the letters are, oh, do you see what I just did there? Oh, goodness me. Actually, that's not even the same drill. Send help. I am not okay, <laughs> but it's my own fault because I haven't put a tray underneath to even help. But it also doesn't help if you throw the packet around. So let's just pop all of those back in where they belong. Now, I am planning on doing a whip and chat with um, working on one of these kits. Um, probably the larger one, the one that I'll be kitting up next. Um, but... I don't do many whipping chats and so what I need you to do in order for that whipping chat to happen is I need some questions from you guys. I need you to pop me a, um, a comment down below to let me know what it is that you want to ask me um, or want to know about me in the um, whipping chat. So if I have enough questions thrown at me um, to keep me talking along for maybe an hour um in a whip and chat then that is what will happen so i do need your help with doing that i know some people read the comments back um in whip and chat videos but i respond to you to the comments directly every time um when you post them anyway so um i'm not going to go and reread them all out on a video so i need your help what do you what do you want to know about me um or ask me ask me anything so I will, um, I'll be as open and honest as I can be. Um, so if you want to know anything about me personally, then feel free to drop that in the comments. If you want to know, um, I don't know, how many paintings I've got, how many um, Diamond Art Club, my favourite artist. If you want to know my favourite music. I mean, I don't know anything you want to ask me. Um, if I get plenty of questions, then um, that will keep me going for um, to be able to do some whip and chats. So keep those questions coming and I will be happy to do a, um, I'll be happy to do some whip and chats. But I need, I need, I need some questions from you in order to do that. So that would be really appreciated if you could, um, if you could drop me some questions in the comments down below, that'd be brilliant. Um, that one's a random one from nowhere. Okay, so we're moving on. So how does this work? So this is, so this one's 741. Okay, so I'm going to just pop these on in order. And then I think because the drills, the train of drills are in this order. And then what I'll do is I'll move the alphabet around so they are um, in alphabetical order because then it'll be easier um, for me when I am working on it. So that's another beautiful AB. So I think there's just two ABs in this kit. So I'm going to leave that one up there. And then let's figure this out, actually. So we've got A, B, C, D, E, 
F, G. So seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So G is going to be there. And then H. Um, there's no I. H, no I. And then we've got J, K. So L is going to be there. Okay. So let's pop this one on here. That's a bit of a random way of dealing with this, but it'll just save me having to move them all around afterwards. So 742. So the DMC code um, is on the bag as well. So that will help make sure that um, the correct drills are um, being used for the correct symbol. So that was L. And then I've got R. Oh, this is going to be annoying. Actually, let's pop the... I'm just making this difficult on myself. I really am. So B. C. D. This is where I figured out I've got it wrong. I can always move them. E. F, G. So I did get that right. H. I don't think there's any I. So then it moves on to J. K, L. It's odd that you get an M and an N. You don't quite often get that. M. N, and you get a Q in here. Again, another odd move. O. But I've looked at the drill field and I don't see there being an issue. So the Qs look very clear. O, P, Q. And I've got R stuck to my finger. Hello, Bella. That's my doggy. One of my doggies. Yes, she's just woken from a nap. Heard her snoring. T, there's no U, so then we've got V, um, X, Y, Z, and then we've got an ampersand, and then a hashtag, and then some random symbol, which I don't know what that is, but there we are. Okay, so... And I've just done this in the most random order, but um, <laughs> it, is, it is what it is. Uh, I'm just going to make do because it was easy just for me to stick the stickers down. So 777 is that one. Let's pop that there. So I'm just going to use the DMC numbers on the bags to, to do this. And these bags are a little crinkled up, so it makes it a little harder to get them out. But... There are only 35 colours. So, and what I've done on here, I've actually just kept the bottom row for the numbers and then I've put the letters on the next three rows and then the symbols because I've got space in here. Now, if it turns out I'm going to need more than one pot, um, that may change. So we'll have to see what happens. So this is 791, which is that one. Oh, did it again. I need to make sure that the packet's actually empty before I um, chuck it in the air. Right, 791. Probably going to be covered in drills when I stand up. Then we've got your... Ah, okay, here we have 823. So we've got two bags of those. Now, if they're going to fit into one pot, where are you? 823. Mm, yeah, B. Hoping maybe if we can get both bags in one pot, but we will see. Oh, I haven't cut that, cut that open enough. There we are. Right, come on. Yeah, we'll get two in here, I think. No problem. <clears throat> okay. That one. Nice big bag of eight two three. A nice big pot of eight two three. Okay, there we are. I'm 
go in that. And then we have um, one bag of 829. Where are you? 829, that is letter T. Bella, go and get in your bed, pups. Go and get in your bed. All right, 829. Then we have one bag of uh, 831. 831, 831. Am I being blind? Probably. Eight, there we go, P. And the colours on the, the slippers actually help as well to navigate to the correct pot. So there's several different ways that I could have done this. I started one way with the um, doing it by order of the drills, but then changed my mind and started doing it by order of the stickers. Um, but it's okay. I'll get the end result. 832. That's that one there. And the... Uh, the more drills I get kitted up, the less bottles I'll have to choose from anyway. So there we go. Three, two. And then we have, oops, eight, nine, two, which is Q. Definitely need to sharpen my scissors. Okay. Oh. That's an escapee. There we go. That can go in there. And then we have 893. That can go in there. That's an electric pink. That's a Barbie pink. Now, I don't know if, about you guys, but I'm super excited about this Barbie movie that's just come out or coming out. Um, I, I, I want to... <laughs> and see it my husband um is absolutely not going to um to go with me um but i think it looks really good that just reminded me that nice pink color barbie pink okay number 900 oh i think i'm gonna have an issue with these falling everywhere oh, i won't learn my lesson i should just grab a tray But then I like to live dangerously. So there we go. That's 900 done. In they go. And then we have number 902. That is that one. Just keeping an eye out for um, any colours where there's more than one bag of drills. Just so I can anticipate it. Um, I can see coming up we've got multiple bags so I might end up having to change my strategy of where these drills go. 906, that's that one, um, because when I've got multiple pots I like them to sit next to each other um, in the storage case. So if that happens I will be budging some of these over. Okay, then we have 907, but we'll see where those multiple bags go, whether they belong um, to one of the letters or whether they belong to one of the symbols. Hopefully the symbols, because that'll be much easier for me to be able to move those over. Okay, then we've got 915. And that one is here. Let's get that open. In they go. All in, apart from one wanted to escape. Okay, 915. Then we have 934. Uh, 934, there. It's a dark green. Okay. 
Then we have nine three eight. So that's that one. Come on. There we go. And then those can go in there. There we are. And I think this is where we've got the multiple. So 939, 939, 939, 939, 939, 939. Ah! Okay, where are you? 939. You are A. Of course you are. Right. Let us see how we can, how many we can get. So I should be able to get two of these bags in a pot although these seem quite full compared to oh goodness me um let's see can i get two bags in if so i'll have to end up using three pots for three pots for these drills so let's see if i can squeeze these into a pot yeah i think that's in Okay, so that is 939. So yeah, I'm going to need, and I think all of the other colours are, they're all singles, so that's fine. So I'm going to need an extra two spaces. So I'm going to move these along. Um, T, and then we want to move that one, that one. And I know that I could put these just at the top, but I like them next to each other so I know how many pots of something that I've got. I just find it easier. And it, in hindsight, yes, it would have been easier just to rearrange these after I'd filled the pots, but um, there we are. I like to... Um, I like to make my life difficult. So, this is going to be... Another pot of 939. Now I could label these. I don't tend to, and I know that's dangerous. Um, but um, I, yeah, I don't tend to label the um, the extra pots because they sit next to the one that is labelled. So I know it's that pot. Um, and to be fair, it's 939, so I'm very likely to know what colour it is anyway. Um, because this colour features in a lot of kits. Along with what, 310, 823, 3865. So I could label them, but I'm going to be a daredevil and not. Okay, and then we have 947. Um, 947 is there. And we are nearly coming to the end of the first kit. Now, someone said that um, there's been an issue with them running out of drills on one of these kits. So I'm going to keep you, I'm going to keep you updated on how I get on. Um, and if there is an issue with the drills um, on missing, if there's not enough drills, sorry, not drills missing, but there's not enough drills in your kit. Um, I strongly encourage you just to reach out to Art Doc. Their customer service is brilliant. So um, reach out to them and they will, I'm sure they'll sort it out. Um, I haven't seen those comments myself, um, so I don't really know what the issue is. Um, and I'll see how I get on with the drills in my kit. But I mean, there look to be plenty of drills here for um, a uh, this size painting. And I'll see, I'll have a look at that in comparison to the bigger one as well um because i'd expect there to be kind of you know double this amount for the other painting although it is still the same amount or similar amount of colors i think right 995 i love this color uh 995 that can go in there oh come on you didn't want to come out I mean, it's not a huge amount, but then, I mean, to be fair, I wouldn't expect a huge amount of this colour in that painting. So, uh, then we have 996, which is its little neighbour. 
and I might between this and the next kitting up I might go and uh, grab myself a fresh drink let the dog out sigh that might be why she's wandering around for 3326 uh, 3326 there. and then <clears throat> give my back a stretch because I certainly I always struggle with kitting up with my back I think it's kind of the leaning over I've got I've got hip and back issues anyway but um so yeah kitting up's not always my friend but um I always get a bad a bad back so the more there is to do um the more my back hurts but they um I'm <laughs> I've got I'm sure I've said in another video I've ordered the outside the sweet shop from Diamond Art Studio now that is due that's on a pre-order and that's due to arrive in august that's 197 colors um so yeah that can, you, oh, I, I don't know how i'm going to kit that up um i have sent a message to um uh is it diamonds and washi that did the kit um because she's done some videos on it and i've asked her if she would give me a list of um she'd give me a list of how she's organized her colors because it looks like she did hers in um like color family which looks to be the most sensible option but i've not heard back from her yet so um yeah just trying to think of ways that's going to be best to kit up um that because that will i will be using my 240 pot um art dot case for that one so anyway um i now have an oh <laughs> it's alive um this is what i mean about these um foam things i literally pick that up and it doesn't bend it's brilliant um i've now kitted that up um so these are all the drills for the 35 by um the 45 um sorry that uh yeah 35 colors let me look in the other one because what i want to do is i want to figure out how i'm going to distinguish between the two paintings as in to know which tray is um you know which drills so i think it's going to be obvious because the color palettes are completely different on these but let's just see because what i don't want is any confusion over the um which drills belong to which tray if that makes sense so uh in this one there are yes 35 colors in this one as well um so these obviously have different um, A, Bs and stuff. So I think what I'm going to need to do um, is maybe just mark a pot um, just to say uh, which one is which. Actually, has this got the canvas number on? A, D, yes. Okay. So I think probably what I'll do is if I cut into this sheet, a, a Y2535. So let me just cut. Because this is a sticker sheet. So what I can do. Um, I don't know if this sticker is going to be too big now, but we'll see. What I can do is just cut the, uh, the canvas number off the sticker sheet. And... Yeah, let's trim this down a little because it's going to be too big for that sticker, that pot, sorry. Let's trim there. And let's trim there. Okay, so if I just pop the um, the canvas number on the top right-hand pot, um, that's just going to let me know that this one is the, um, the rose one. And I can tell that because at the bottom here, it's the Y2535. So that is my first set kitted up. And I think, you know, the more I work on this, um, the more I get... Excuse me. Sorry, I've just had a, a sip of Coke. Um, and <laughs> I've got hiccups. So, um, yeah, as I work on this, I think I'll just become second nature to which tray belongs to which. But the rose one is only 25 by 35 so it's not going to take me long um, and this is going to be kitted down um, and done and dusted anyway stay right where you are and then we are going to kit up in the same case the um, butterfly one as well stay tuned okay so moving on 
pop the first tray back in and oh, there we go and then we'll move on just pop that out of the way we'll move on to the second one so this is the butterfly canvas this one i said i've unboxed both of these so do go back and take a look at the unboxings of these if you wish and then let's see what we've got going on with these stickers so i think again we've got numbers and letters so i think i'm just going to stick the stickers onto the pot and that's now my other dog now kind of dondering around she likes to bumble around so just let them out for a little bathroom break so they should be good for a little while Okay, seven, eight, nine. Um, okay, I'm not going to make the same mistake because I might end up having to use more than one bag. So let's see. Sorry, more than one pot. Let's see what we've got here. So let's find number one. Let's see what we've got first. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven eight nine they're all good so 10 11 we've got two bags of 11 so two of those we've got 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 those are all okay and then we have whoops, let's go to the other end of the train 20 21 22 23 24 25 26, 27, 28, 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. Okay, so we've only got one where there's two bags, which is this one. So I'm good to start with um, at least one to nine, which are all the number ones. So these are, these look to be bigger bags than um, the other kit. And, oh have to cut that where it's been bent so it'll go in the pot a lot easier there we go oh come on I still haven't got myself a tray but that's okay so that can go in there that's number one then we have number two I think this is my fault because I really cram these back in the box when I um when I open them. So this is number two zero eight. Those can go in. No, um, no static so far. Just a little bit of an issue with the bags being um bent which makes it a little more difficult to get them out and into the pots but i'd prefer that than static so i'm not going to complain too much very few of these there are literally a handful of 209 so let's get those in so there can't be that many in the picture just a little accent here and there so i definitely need to make sure that i don't drop any of these there we go then we have a beautiful a b that's the yellow one i can't remember if that was the same in the other one or not shake them all the way down and then this is 307 and I think this might correspond to the actual DMC colour let's take a look so I have this colour chart from um, Art Dot which is brilliant so 307 is on row number 14 so on here uh, 307 yeah so that is the ab of 307 so i like the fact that you've actually got the ab uh, sorry the, the dmc numbers that correspond to the um 
uh, the, if that makes sense. <laughs> You've got the, the actual code that corresponds to that DMC colour. Because I know the Diamond Art Club ones, they've obviously got their own um, colour codes. Um, although I have found, I think it was a printable from uh, Joan Diamond Paints. Um, she's got a... Um, she's got a Diamond Art Club to DMC uh, conversion, which I've saved. I just need to print off and pop in my logbook. Right, 434, because that's where I basically store everything. Okay, so number seven. So yeah, there are the same amount of colours in both kits. There are... Um, 35, but... Despite the fact that this is a bigger painting, this one is 66 by 33, whereas the other one's 25 by 35, um, there's a lot more colour blocking in this. Um, where do we get to? Number eight, was it? Yep, yeah, number eight, and that's 445. Again, only a few of these. So I don't think there's going to be masses of drills left over, but we will see. But yeah, don't forget to drop those questions down in the comments section down below so um, I can be armed with some chatty content in order to film a whip and chat with um, one of these kits. Probably the butterfly one. Oh, because I think I might just do the rose one when um, watching telly of an evening. So that is another AB, that is 472. Let's have a look on that colour chart. So 472, 472 is number 11. Let's get those out again, where are they there? 472, so that is the AB for that one. You can see that, you can just see that the colour's the same and then you've just got that AB coating on top. Okay, so, oh. There's a loose one in there. And I say that I'm never um, precious about making sure I've got 100% of the drills from the bags. But when it's the ABs and when there's only a few of them, um, I am. So now moving on. So 500 is A. So that's helpful. So we'll pop that in there. And that's going to be my next row. And as I said in the other tray, because I've got the luxury of um, having 60 pots and only 35 colours, it does mean that I can um, just move. Oh, let's get that in shot a little bit. It does mean that I can move um, the, oh, I can have like spare pots missing um, where... I kind of go numbers and then letters and then symbols on a different row. Okay, so this is where we come to number um, 11. This is 550. There's quite full bags of these. So this beautiful 550. Everybody loves this colour. So let's pop that on. And we'll pop the sticker on the first pot. And as I said, I like to live dangerously. So I don't ever number my following pots because... I know that that's where they belong. Okay, and then let's open this big bag as well. So I think it's going to be three pots of 550 or so. Oops. Pop that one next to it. And then I'll use up the... Um, I'll use up the pots, the empty pots first. Uh, well, the unlabeled pots, should I say, first. And then... I just leave the numbered one in there. Okay, and then we have number 12. So that is 666. So I think what, oh, not that one. Close. What I'm going to do is I will probably just do the drills in order and then I'll um, mess around with getting the bags, yeah, getting the bottles um, in the order that I need them rather than trying to find uh, the bottles. So I might just leave it out. Oh, I've got a random little lime green one. That's that one. Okay. 
There we go. So then we've got J701. Yep, that's that one. And I'm hoping that there was only one that had two bags, but I'm hoping that all of these bags will fit into a pot. They should do, hopefully, but these are bigger bags, so we will see. So that's 701. And then we have L, which is 740. Just checking that DMC number as I go, just to make sure that I have the correct, um, the correct one. Oh. There we go. It yeah. right seven forty. Leave that to one side because I'm looking for when I get to C, which is all the way down the list. Typical. Okay, and then we have O. I'm just going to hope that. Oh, need the lid off for that first. If I don't need a second bag, then I shouldn't need to worry about doing this and shuffling them all over so I could put them in order. Um, so I might do that in a minute when I get to the E. So this is V742. We're almost halfway through this first train. There we are. Um, and then we have E. So I'm going to take a punt on this. 797, again, a really full bag. Let's see if they're all gonna fit. I don't think they will. Oh, no, they're not gonna all fit. Okay. So, so I'm going to leave a space for C um, and hope it's not a big bag, D, E, and then I'm going to have a second pot for the rest of the E's. Okay. And then we have... K, which is 820. Hmm. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Oh, silly me. I've gone to the top of the list. I've still got two stickers at the bottom. Let's leave that to one side. Let's try that again. We've got X and T to go yet. So X814. That can go in. And oh, still one in there. Come on. Yep, that's that, that's that in. And then we have 815. And that is tea. Oh, be nice, a lovely cup of tea. And then up to the top, and we have U. these on here because I can just fill them in order then. That might be the easiest way around it and then I can just get rid of the sticker sheet. Well not get rid of it but out of my space. H Z three eight three four Three eight three seven 
nine, uh, sorry, three, eight, four, three, three, eight, four, six, and three, eight, five, two. Okay, let's pop that sticker sheet over there for a second. Okay, so we're on to the second train now. And that should be K, okay, which is the bowl that I'd already pulled out. And this looks to be a chunky bag too. So let's see, maybe might be all right with this one. Yeah, we're good. We're safe. So that is K. There we are. And then we have U 891. Again, no issues with static, which is brilliant. None so far. Come on. Just got a little bit of a bent bag to contend with. Right, you. And we have the ampersand. 892. And there you go. And I think I'm going to end up using three rows for the um, alphabet. So I'm going to pop the uh, I'm going to pop the little symbol ones on the fifth row, and that should be fine. Oh, I still didn't get it out. <laughs> right there we go. Right eight nine two. Come on. Right, that's that one done. Then we have um, 895. Oh, we've got a random drill there. So let me know um, as well, did you pick up these art dot kits? Um, I think that they are very good value in terms of what you get. Obviously, I haven't completed one to know the quality just yet, but um, everything that I've seen so far, I've been very impressed with. So um, I've been looking forward to getting these completed so I could actually do a proper review on them. Um, 906, this might be two bottles. Mm. Yep. So we have F which can go there and we'll take that empty one and we'll pop the rest of them in there and spill them everywhere of course so that's another bottle of f2 um did i get to g no it's one of the next ones coming up okay so yeah let me know and if you have got these kits have you completed them? What were your thoughts? Um, let me know. So we've got a hashtag. And I'm going to need two bottles for that too. Not much in the second bottle, so that shouldn't take long to get through those. Um, okay, and then we have um g939 our little friend our regular visitor 939 let's get those in there should be able to get all those in yeah and that's not always an issue not being able to get all those in because i have plenty of 939 spare so 939 and then we have Nine four seven. Again, no. Oh, what's wrong with me today? Right, that's a Q. Then, do we have? We've got the H coming up, but oh, actually, D's next. Oh no, I think I'm going to need two bottles. Let's see. This one seems a pretty full bag.
Okay. Well, this didn't work out too well, did it? Um, where is C? So that's going to be H Z R M C. I tell you what, I'm going to break the train. Sorry, everyone. Because I'm just going to get C out because if C needs two pots as well, then I'm going to need to squidge two bowls along, which I think might be the case by the looks of things. Yep. Okay, so that's fine. So let's pop the C ones in. Let's move that over and move those over there and those over there. And then we want a spare pot for the rest of these. There we go. Oh, someone shout at me if you see spare drills left in the packet. Okay, so that is that, and then we've got D, and then we've got the rest of the rest of these ones too. There we go. Okay. That's that. And then we move on. And then we've got H, which is 996, which must be this one here. Let's pop that in the bin. I could see the end. I should all go in. Yeah. Okay. Right. H. There's no I. Have I done J? I have done J. K. I think I've done. K. Yes. And then I've done L. M's coming up. And that should be okay. Uh, 3837. Yeah, that'll be fine for that. Actually, let's just do that now. Because I've only got a few packets left anyway. So I just didn't want to kind of go out a sequence of the, the train of drills because it's easier just to do them in order. Okay, so that's M. N. And then we have O. There's no P by the looks of things. Oh, there is a P. Sorry, it's a it's an AB one. <gasps> Three ABs in this one. P is here. Three eight four six. This beautiful blue AB. You can see those. Beautiful. Oh, if we can contend with the packet. Tiny bit of static in these. It's because I said something. Okay, so that is P. P can go there. And then we have Q. And then we have R coming up. So R is 3834. Which is this one. I obviously jinxed it because there was a little bit of static in those as well. So weird. Okay, so we have R, and then Z needs to come out. And then we have S, T, U, V, no W, X. And then here's my final two, Y and Z. Uh, three, eight, three, eight, five, two, that's this one. Should know by the color. Okay, let's get all of those in there. Done. And then we have 3761. Done. So I'm going to do the same on this as what I did on the, um, oh no, that's not the sticker sheet, it's this one, isn't it? Um, I'm gonna cut out the canvas number. So if I'm ever confused with um, which 
which kit the drills belong to, which canvas. Um, then I've just got this stuck to a bottle for quick reference, um, which I'll just pop in. Oh, I've done it again. I need to cut it down a little bit. Just a bit too big. There we go. So pop that on the top bottle so I can refer to that um, and the bottom of the canvas just to know that I have definitely got the um, definitely got the right canvas for the drills so let's pull the case back in and then pop that one in there so what I'm going to do with my sticker sheets um, until I'm ready to put those in my logbook I need to print off some more logbook sheets that's why I've not done it um, I'll just pop those in the top so I have them ready to go. And I have my two canvases kitted up, ready to start working on the rose one and the beautiful butterfly one. So thanks very much for joining me for today. As I said, don't forget to drop um, me some questions in the comments down below. You can drop multiple um, questions as well. So don't feel free to feel free to um to ask as many questions as you like um and i look forward to reading those if i get enough like i said i'll do um i'll start doing some whipping chats um and don't forget to give the video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it subscribe if you're new hit the bell notification so you know when i next upload and i will see you again in the next video bye